Well, Chris, you just chimed in for a second. Chris Meyer from Maxis, you were talking about competition and you know having more brands. I, I assume you're going to probably parallel what Dave is saying about seeing a lot of different decks or proposals. Yeah. Uh, what makes yeah. them stick out? I, I know that you and I were talking that you know sponsorship is a business. So you, yeah, I mean, I, I, the, a business for the brand. The ones that have been put together thoughtfully that. Um, the the people that are put together are aware that they're they're a business and a brand and they're they're approaching it like that I, to to the points just made you know that they understand they've got to find a hole where we need them you know we're not we're not we're not a charity um, you know I mean there's there's certainly passion in the industry there's a lot of passionate people that work for us and work with us and we're fans of the sports we're involved in but we can't make bad business decisions or we won't have jobs. We won't be able to provide product to sponsored athletes. So there has to be a need. So I think it's important in a deck that um, that's very concisely and quickly communicated. It's no different than uh, taking the time to research the company that you're applying for a job with mm -hmm, mm -hmm. and, and sprinkling, sprinkling the language that you find on their website into into your pitch deck and making sure that your photography is of a professional quality, that you're taking this seriously. You're asking someone to give you money. What are you trading for? Exactly. Because if it's just results, that may not be enough. 